Today I'm going to film another cooking video for you guys. I have a bunch of you guys that really like the cooking videos. So I was going to make something tonight that I haven't made in a while. So I figured I would film it for you guys because I haven't done that yet. So today we're going to be making chicken crock pot, chicken and stuffing in the crock pot basically. So what you're going to need is you're going to need some chicken breasts. And now I got this big, big package here because I wanted plenty of food for tonight and leftovers for my husband for tomorrow at work. So, I am using, let's see, how many pounds is this? This is 2.64 pounds. So, you guys can use as less or as more as you want. It doesn't really matter. But, you're going to need some chicken breasts. You're going to need 10 to 12 ounces of your favorite um, stuffing. I'm just using this one right here. This Hill County Fair turkey flavored stuffing because I also got some turkey gravy that I'm going to be using tonight to pour over it. Um, so, I got two boxes of this because these are only six ounce boxes. So, I'm going to be using 12 12 ounces of um, stuffing. You're going to need some chicken broth and I'm just using this one right here. The 100% fat free, no MSG, 33% less sodium, all natural by Swanson. And you're also going to need a can of um, cream of chicken soup. The very first step you're going to do is go ahead and put your chicken in the crock pot here. And then you're going to take, if you're using as much chicken as me, then you're going to want to take at least a cup and a half to two cups of your chicken broth and you're going to want to just go ahead and pour it in on top of your chicken i may add a little bit more i'm not sure well actually let me just put like i don't know a little splash more who knows but definitely a cup and a half of chicken broth if you're using as much as me okay now that that's in there you're going to take a different bowl and you're going to take your stuffing and you're basically just going to pour it in your bowl and you're going to mix it with the soup and you're going to mix it with about, I don't know, I would say three-fourths cup of water if you're using the same amount of stuffing as me. I'm going to be using 12 ounces. If you're only going to be using 10 ounces, just put about a half a cup of water in it, um, mix it all together, and then we're going to put it on top of our chicken. Okay, guys, I have my stuffing and my water. I used the one can of... Um, the one can of soup and three about three fourths cups of water and mixed it with both of my boxes of stuffing and this is what you get so now basically what you're going to do is you're going to put it on top of the chicken and the chicken broth and you're going to pack it down to where it's nice and nice and smooth Okay, here we go. So you guys can see I have the stuffing in my crock pot. It is nice and packed down on top of my chicken. Now that is all you're going to do. You're just going to go ahead and put your lid on it and you're going to cook it on low for about six hours. If you need it to be done quicker, you can turn it on high and cook it for about three and a half to four hours. But keep in mind that the stuffing is going to get a lot more crispier around the edges because that's what's actually touching the crock pot. But the chicken broth that you poured in there is going to help the stuffing. Like the stuffing is going to soak up that chicken broth and everything's going to like be so super good once it's all done. But I'm going to cook mine on low for about six, six and a half hours for us to eat it for dinner tonight. And with it, I'm just going to make some mashed potatoes. We're going to have some turkey gravy to pour over top of that. We're going to have some type of vegetable, whether it be green beans or peas or something like that. And then we're going to have some, um, um, home style biscuits to go with it so that's what i always make with this dish and um yeah so anyway tonight when it gets done i will show you guys what it looks like but definitely definitely make sure that you cook it like i said low at least six hours and you can cook it on high for about three and a half to four hours so tonight when it gets done i'll be back and show you guys what it looks like Okay guys, here is the chicken and stuffing. As you guys can see, it is all the way done now and it looks super, super good. It's really moist and there's nothing dry about it. I'm going to get out some chicken and I'll show you guys once I plate it what it looks like. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys again in my next video.